Hey, what's going on, guys? Happy New Year, by the way. Uh, you know what's ended last week? The CES 2025 in Las Vegas. It's the Consumer Electronic Show where they announce a bunch of new tech. And it, this year it was mostly about robots. Uh, they just announced maybe four or five drones. So let's go inside and talk about the specs of all those drones and tech. And welcome back. I have my tea right there. My laptop is ready. So let's talk about the first drone at this CES. Uh, it's the Agamosphere by a company called DIC. Yeah, Dick. What did you say? <laughs> I hope it's a good company. It's mostly a concept model. I didn't see any demo uh, of it in the air. Uh, I just saw it on a table in some videos. And they say it's a spherical design omnidirectional multicopter. And it's supposed to be for search and rescue and uh, be adapted to for any environments. Um, they don't talk about the battery life at all, so I don't know if it's gonna last forever. But what's the most interesting part is in the website, you can see it can roll. It can roll and adapt its movement. I, I wonder if it can roll in the air. <laughs> it would be very interesting to, to see. I don't know what more to say about this uh, drone. It's mostly a prototype. Second drone unveiled at the CES 2025 is the underground drone made by Skyflight NCO University. Uh, it's equipped uh, with LiDAR for places where you don't have any GPS. So in that case, <laughs> underground, you don't have any uh, reception for that. It's equipped, uh, outfitted with a 360 impediment detection and AI imaging. So it can fly anywhere it's supposed to be autonomous. Um, they don't say the price, they don't state the battery life. Uh, all you can see is this uh, design over there. The third drone is a cleansing drone. It's made by Wyson or Wyson, I don't know how to pronounce that name, but yeah. It's lightweight, it's 1.3 kilograms. It can fly uh, to clean windows and also to clean uh, photovoltaic panels. Um, it's very sturdy and can clean, they say, up to 800 meters square per hour. So it's a very powerful uh, cleaning drone. I would love to have this one to clean my, my windows over there. They don't say how long it lasts, but it says that it's equipped with AI-enabled adaptability. So yeah, it's all about AI this year. AI here and there. We, we saw a lot of robots this year. So yeah, AI is coming. Tea break. Oh, look. <laughs> I broke it. <laughs> I broke my cup. Oh, God damn it. <sighs> hey, I fixed it. <laughs> and the fourth drone in this list that I find the most interesting is the Urban Bladeless Delivery Drone System by Eros and Ansio University. As you can see, it doesn't have any blades, so it uses a propulsion technology and it looks like a UFO, man. So uh, just for a cool factor of it. Um, and because it doesn't have any propellers, it uh, reduces the, the noise by 40%. So it's perfect for urban environments that you want to have uh, your pizza delivered very fast. And you know what? It can carry up to 10 kilograms cargo. So. Wow, it's powerful. It's also equipped with AI-based uh, smart fly system, so it can avoid any obstacles in the area. So I'm very curious to see it in, in flight and to have your food delivered by a drone. It's coming, it's coming. Oh well, let's go outside for the outro. That's about it on the drones announced at the CES this year. Uh, if you uh, like this video, you know what to do. Thank you so much for encouraging this channel. I love you guys. Fly safe, guys, and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.